Yeah, because if we're looking, obviously in the short term, I think it will still be we'll still be stuck with volatility because like the obviously people are <clears throat> obviously the uh, trade uh, dispute like the news flow coming out changes every day. So, but then I think people have been pricing it pretty negatively. If we're looking at the uh, China, Hong Kong and China markets, obviously the uh, the valuations I think right now has come down to a reasonable level. If we're looking at Hong Kong right now, the Hang Seng Index trading at about 11 and a half times versus like a 10 year average of 12.5. So obviously we're below uh, the 10 year average right now. So I think people have been pricing in that pretty negative scenario. But and I think the key issue like going forward is to look at what's going to happen with the uh, trade dispute. I think pe like I think the negotiations will definitely drag on. So so I think this will be a long term thing. But then I think people will be pricing in and then people will be sort of like a couple of weeks ago, like people will be sort of like uh, immune to it <clears throat> going forward. So I think people will be turning to back to focusing on fundamentals towards the uh, second half of the year, like <clears throat> in July and August when the uh, results, interim results for the Chinese companies come out, I think people will say, okay, they still look okay. China fundamentals are still good. I think that's going to be like sort of a turnaround point for long term. So if we're looking at for buying right now, I think right now, in terms of a long-term buying, I think right now it's already kind of a good current level to look at. But then if you're looking at short-term, then obviously you are still you might want to still stay on the sidelines. But then long-term, I think right now it's a good time to buy for like Chinese banks or insurance or like the large caps, tech, etc. Hey everybody, it's Hadley Gamble from our new CNBC Middle East Bureau in Abu Dhabi. Thanks for stopping by. Now to watch more, you can try one of the videos that just popped up on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe.